And also at City Council tonight, approved criteria for determining which nonprofits and public organizations will get Google Fiber for free. It's expected to be up and running by mid 2014 here in Austin. KXAN's Angie Bevan has more on the plans, including when you could get fiber. We know two places that'll receive free Google Fiber, Austin City Hall and the new Central Library, currently under construction. 100 other public facilities and nonprofits will get the speedy broadband too. But who? I would say probably the schools, of course. I do volunteer at Dress for Success, uh, which is a nonprofit here in Austin. Maybe even some of the churches who kind of do the nonprofits. The city will accept applications to be one of the hundred. Thursday, council members approved a checklist of sorts for staff to follow when determining which organizations qualify for free fiber. Here are some key points. Selected sites should be spread out geographically. They should serve diverse populations, and the site should range from government to education to social services to healthcare type facilities. Switching gears now. So you want Google Fiber in your home. They never say exactly where it's going to be. How do you get it? From Condero to Armordale. In Kansas City, where Google first rolled out fiber, they built a network where the demand was. But history might not repeat itself. We were there to a spokesperson told us in Kansas City, the fiber hoods that pre-registered the highest percentage of residents got fiber first. But that's not necessarily how we'll do it in Austin. We haven't announced the sign-up process or installation schedule yet. I think it would be really Really successful in Hyde Park. I think Hyde Park residents would would totally be into it. Like the criteria for nonprofits and public places, some say keep it balanced. They're going to give it to the neighborhoods, make sure they distribute it e equally across Austin. In Austin, Angie Bevan, KXAN News. And as for public organizations and those nonprofits, application for free Google Fiber will be available on Monday on the city's webpage. Deadline for submission is September 30th. The city has to send out its list of 100 to Google by the end of this year. And as for the competitors, Texas-based AT&T reiterated to KXAN today they're interested in developing a fiber network as well. Spokesperson said the company is making progress to ensure they receive the same treatment as other fiber projects. Time Warner responded as well tonight talking about a wide range of options for customers needs and pricing and adding television channels and service while no mention of fiber the company has already launched Wi-Fi hotspots allowing customers to get better access to data and by the way it looks like Austin will technically be the third city to have Google Fiber up and running that's because of what's going on in Utah now after taking over another fiber company in Provo reports are Google will make upgrades and be offering the high-speed data there by the end of this year